guys welcome to my youtube channel i hope you are all well and keeping safe i have put together this whole halloween inspired jasmine look for you guys so stay tuned until the end and you will see how i create this whole look including how to do a diy hair do with the gems and everything so yeah i really hope you enjoyed watching this video so I'm going to start with doing my eyes first because the whole vibe of Jasmine, her accessories, her hair, but it's also the way she has her dramatic eye makeup. Well, in the previous version, not this version, but you know. So yeah, I, I'm just going to go in with my eyes. I'm going to start off by just prepping my eyes and I'm going to use my prep and set from Makeup by Mario. I love this as a primer, I think it works really nicely. I'm gonna go in with a flat brush. And I'm just gonna use the powder. So using the Mario palette, I'm gonna go in with the shades eight, Oh, now I'm going in with the dark brown and black to create that depth in this area. And now just going in with another fluffy brush, I'm just going to soften this up here, but just slightly drag it into my eye. So using the Jaclyn Hill palette, I'm going in with the shade Living My Best, but I am just applying this into the crease of my eye. Now I'm going to go back in with my prep and set and using my flat brush, I'm taking the darker shade and literally just applying this over my lid. The thing about this prep and set is that it allows you to actually like move, move the actual pigment. Sometimes when you use concealer or actual primer, it gets quite dry very quickly. I'm gonna go in with my Urban Decay palette and I'm gonna mix the shade Blindsided and Metamorphous, like a blue pigment. Now going back in with my brown from the Mario palette. I'm just going to go into my crease and just mix these colours together. And then once again go in with the blue and just layer away because I've just taken some off. I'm going to go in with the gold master crystal reflex from Mario. I'm going to go in and do my eyeliner. So I am going to use my Huda Beauty one. We are gonna go in with the gold. This is Midnight Cowboy by Urban Decay. Okay, I'm gonna literally go and do the same on the other eye and I'll be back before I do the next step. So guys, I have literally gone and just finished my eyes and I've put some lashes on. I am so excited. The Jasmine look is totally coming together. I'm just gonna moisturize my face and start my base. One of the tricks that I did with my lashes, I kept them longer than my actual lash line and that way it adds to the elongation effect. And then I've gone for like um, fluttery eyelashes 
more sort of cat eye look so it gives you that added effect on the edge so i've just gone and quickly moisturized and i'm going to go in with my huda beauty I'm so excited to see everyone's Halloween look. I'm gonna go in with my little mix that I have. Those of you that don't know my mix, you really need to watch my um, video on how I set my face with translucent powders. And I've come up with this little formula. I'm going to go in with my NARS Orgasm Blush to give that perfect pop of pink. Now guys, under the eyes, I'm going to go back to my Mario palette and just choose the shade of brown which is closest to my skin colour and I mix that with one shade darker than my skin colour. Going in with the gold from earlier. Guys, this is the finished makeup look. And now I've got my blue jasmine dress on. And now it's time to do the hair. So the wig isn't actually made into Jasmine's hairstyle. I've got to actually create it. Jasmine, why did you have to have such long hair? This is literally the finished look and I am so excited of doing this because literally, as you have seen, this was a lot of effort. I hope you've liked it and it's so strange being in this wig. Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you've enjoyed watching my Halloween glam and yeah, thank you so much guys. 